What is one thing that real warplane maneuvers and your in-game aircraft have in common? The engine. Although in the game, the engine is mostly handled for you. It may not be apparent, but we're talking about sound. 100 kilometers inland from Los Angeles. Two weeks of scorching heat. Six men and 18 real warplanes. Many of them traveled alone to the shoot in the Plains of Fame Aviation Museum. The valves of the Soviet Yak-3 used to cling like this when legendary pilot Marcel Albert tried to get his damaged plane to the airport in 1943. Now, the engine roars so that you can climb to the sky and lose your pursuers. You can experience it with the real roaring of the engine instead of a downloaded library sound. All of the exhibits are real planes manufactured from the mid-1930s to the early 1950s. Many of them have seen real combat. Planes with single and twin engines, jets, American, Japanese, Soviet, every single one of them sounds unique. This explains our team's desire to record as much as they can. The Wargaming sound engineers record the now unique sounds of the planes using numerous microphones and several recording tracks at once. Each of them is recorded at a certain angle and at its own distance from the airframe. The starting, low rev, medium sounds, plus the afterburner. We've made the planes sound as real as possible in the game. As a result, the in-game sound in World of Warplanes depends on the camera angle, distance, and the engine's operating modes. You can easily experience them in the game when the plane executes different maneuvers or engages the afterburner, for instance. The sound is like the pilot would hear it from his compartment. Well, it may be a bit quieter. Wargaming sound engineers decided not to edit sound too much. It has remained as authentic as possible to provide an additional presence. The same approach of recording live sound was once used by our Swedish colleagues. But such a high-scale audio project is the first in the history of the industry. The last time these planes were gathered in such a lineup was in 2001, when the movie Pearl Harbor was filmed. Enjoy the atmosphere, pilots!